How much do you know about the knee toil in your machine and if it's the right product for you? Well, I'm here in the MTD CNC studio with Paul from Fuchs to find out about their offering. Now, Paul, talk us through what you've brought with you today. Right, Tom, I've brought three typical products with me today. So if we start with this particular one over here, the one that's darkest in color, that might be what some operators are used to seeing. Relatively viscous product, so quite thick, quite heavy. Uh, it can do the job, but that's probably based on traditional technology. As we start moving up the scale now, we can get products which are based on mineral oil, just like this one, but they're fortified with different additives and they can be a lot cleaner. So this is a lot better for the operation and better for operators. But we can move all the way up to the top end here. So this is a product from our Planto cut range. So this particular product is essentially mineral oil free. It's based on renewable plant ester technology. And before we go into the benefits of how that helps a customer, surely that must be more environmentally friendly as well if you're using plant oil over conventional conventional oils yeah yes it can be because it's from a renewable resource so unlike these particular products which are heavily uh, reliant on on mineral oil as, as an origin this is sourced from a renewable resource so it's it's sourced from plant origin so how does that benefit a customer not just the renewable energy but each product okay so if if we start with the t the more traditional fluid these products are based on mineral oils fortified with additives. Now, the mineral oils, depending on the viscosity of the product, uh, could have a relatively low flash point, which then we have to complement with additives. If we start sliding up towards the Planto technology all the way up here, you've got a, a raw material that not only is it renewable, but it's also got a very high flash point as well because we're now talking about dealing with neat oils. So there's always the risk that's posed with a neat oil of any sparks or, or any risk of fire. So these products have got a very high flash point that make them safer to use. Now, a question I get asked a lot, and I'm hoping you, Paul, as an expert, can help me with an answer I'll be able to give from, from now on is, why would a customer choose neat oil over a cool one? Okay, depending on, on the machine, uh, design engineers or the machine uh, manufacturer, some people prefer to use neat oils over soluble metal working fluids. These could be in typical machines like Swiss machines, uh, they could be in bar autos as well, where really you're making lots and lots of small components, but you're, you're carrying out some, some very delicate operations where lubricity is really the ultimate goal as opposed to cooling. And obviously we always talk about cutting the material and the part itself, but would a neat oil actually help the machine itself? Because obviously with a Swiss machine, every everything inside of, of one of them is moving. And obviously they've got their own um, hydraulic oils and, and slide by oils, but would this also help keep the machine running well as well as the parts? They can do, yeah, because what we want to do is, in, in a typical Swiss machine, if we take these two products, uh, for example, these two products here, uh, they're of the right viscosity and they've got the right complementary additive system which is in there. The whole point of picking a product with the right viscosity and the right additives is we don't want to risk any, any stickiness, we don't want to see any oxidation because over time these oils are put under lots of stress and strain, you don't have to throw them away, if you look after them, if your filtration's working correctly, you can keep topping them up. So the good thing about neat oils is they can last an awful long time but you do have to look after them. And if we complement it with the right chemistry, your machine should be running a lot cleaner for as long as possible. So Paul, just before we finish, have you got any customer stories, customer testimonies where they've been having trouble before, but then obviously you've been in and, and changed onto the Fuchs oil and now the problem's solved? We have, yeah. We, we had um, a, a manufacturer that, that was making uh, components out of high tensile steel. They were carrying out a gun drilling operation, which is a very small radius. Now, with this small radius gun drilling operation, which was a blind hole, previous technology, which they were using, was, was not giving them the surface finish that, that they wanted to achieve. But with our Planto technology, uh, they got the final surface finish that they wanted. Because you can imagine, if you're doing a blind hole gun drilling operation with a very small radius, 
the last thing that you want to suffer from is poor lubricity and getting poor surface finish. So the Planto range really was a genuine problem solver for that customer. Well, Paul, from me and everybody at MTD CNC, I'd like to, to thank you for coming into the studio today. And if um, any of the viewers at home have learned anything or want to know more about the products you spoke about, how can they get in contact with you? If you type in Fuchs Lubricants UK uh, into your search engine, you should be able to pick us up that way. But otherwise, you can pick us up going straight to our website, which is fuchs.com and then forward slash UK. That'll take you straight to the UK homepage. We are a global company, but if you go straight to the UK homepage, there's lots of information you can find on there about all of our range of products. Well, Paul, thank you for your time. Thank you.